Hello students and friends. In this video, I will discuss about the nitration of aniline and derivatives. Okay. So actually, yeah, aniline on nitration gives a uh, 51 percentage para product and 2 percentage uh, ortho product and 47 percentage actually this nh2 is electron donating group so this electron donating group is the ortho para directing group so majorly electrophile attacks on the ortho and para position but in this case meta is also formed in a higher quantity so why because this nitration must be carried out in the presence of the acid like a h2so4 here in this case this H2SO4 is a proton donor, you know that this proton attacks on the NH2 because this amine is a basic in nature. So protonation of that NH2 takes place and that becomes NH3 plus. Okay. So in this case, this NH3 plus is a strong minus I group and this one deactivate the benzene ring as well as that minus I electron withdrawing groups are the meta directing group. So majorly NO2 plus L profile attacks at the meta position. That's why 47 percentage of meta product is formed. Okay. So in this case, some amount of the anion is uh, protonated. So we'll get this one. Of course, this compound after attacking of the NO2 at meta position. So this compound is must be quenched with the uh, ammonia hydroxide solution that basically more the H3 plus. So we'll get the NH2. That means. Uh, Para meta nitro aniline. Okay. Now, this is the nitration of the aniline. And next, uh, let us consider the nitration of the N methyl aniline. Okay. And next, uh, N and dimethyl aniline. Okay. So, in this case, in case of the aniline nitration, para is a major product. Of course, uh, 51 percent is uh, that means very uh, minor uh, quantity that major product. Okay, very less difference 47 and 51 percent. But if we come into the N methyl aniline and N and dimethyl aniline, we will get the major product that is meta isomer as a major product. Why? Because in this case, uh, meta product is formed as a major product because it is explained on the basis of the uh, basicity. So actually, this N and dimethyl aniline is more basic than the n methyl anion and it is more basic than the aniline compound. So because are, these are the plus i groups, so plus i groups increase the basic nature. So this is the more basic compound. Now, so this n and dimethyl in nitration, so it is a more basic compound. So here the ready protonation of this n and dimethyl takes place. Okay. So that means here the more amount of the n and dimethyl get protonation. So that becomes a electron vector drawing group. So your N plus CH3 and this one CH3 and this one H. So actually here higher concentration of the N and dimethyl get protonation because it is a strong base. But in this case of aniline, it is a weak base when compared to this N and dimethyl aniline. So this weak base, some concentration of the aniline get, proton uh, get uh, uh, protonation. So that's why uh, we will get the 47 percentage of the minor product and the major product is a para. But in this case, this is a more basic compound, is also more basic compound when compared to aniline. So that's where ready protonation takes place. That means here protonation takes place rapidly and it is converted to that uh, electron vector drying group. Okay, so because of the higher basic nature, here more concentration of the N methyl aniline and N and dimethyl aniline are converted to this pass to ion. This pass to uh, group is a strong electron with the drying group. So ultimately that attacks uh, electrophile attacks at the meta position. That's why meta product is major. Okay. So this is the previous uh, NSCC question also. So that's why here in this case and remaining two compounds meta is a major product. Okay. And next. Uh, so how to get this uh, para nitro aniline as a major product. Okay. That means in higher quantity. So here in this case, this compound aniline on acylation in the presence of acetic anhydride, that compound is converted to acetonylide. 
okay this is acetonylide now this acetonylide is less basic because this lone pair of electrons are involved in the conjugation with this co group is the electron with the drying group so it is less basic so here protonation of this nh group is not uh, that means it is not a rapid it's not a uh, takes place uh, rapidly so here in this case we will get the ortho product and para product but in this case this no2 is a bulky group and this uh, sorry nhcos is a bulky group and this no2 is a bulky group of course a slightly bulky uh, in size so that's why no2 l profile majorly attacks at the para position so we will get the para product as a major now in this case this amide on a hydrolysis uh, we, we will get the amide okay so in this way we get the we can get the para nitro adenine as a major product okay because uh, direct uh, nitration of this one we will get the uh, different products but in this case after converted into acetonylide this nhcoc3 this nitrogen is less basic so protonation is not considerable so that's why we will get the pure ortho and the para products but here para is formed in a major quantity okay so here protonation is not considerable that's why we will get the ortho and para as a major product now in this case ortho sorry para nitro aniline is formed in a major yield now how to get ortho nitro aniline as a major product so now first of all this uh, nh2 converted into that amide group is a weak donating group and weak basic so this one on sulfonation that so3h is a bulky group so the in higher yield para product is formed and now this compound on nitration that no2 plus l profile attacks at the ortho position here there is no chance for the para position para position is blocked by the so3h and ultimately that no2 plus l profile attacks at the ortho position now we have a benefit with the sulfonation that is nothing but desulfonation so any sulfonated compound on heating with dilute acid on heating with dilute acid desulfonation takes place that is replaced by the h plus l profile this substitution is nothing but ipso substitution so ultimately we got ortho nitro aniline as a major product okay now this is a mechanism of the desulfonation 